in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, when we listen to the sermon, to the Bible lesson, we just finished now. They said, the Bible said when it was eight days, eight days, they brought Jesus into the sun child to christen him, to bless him. Uh, when we, we remember, we see that there's a man in the Bible that this man is waiting for the glory, waiting for Jesus to see Jesus. One thing I want you to understand there. Can you help me read the verse again? Just only one verse. Verse 25. Verse 25. And behold, there was a man in Jerusalem whose name was Simeon. Yes. And the same man was just and devout. Was just. And devout. Was just and devout. Can you see that man? Thank you. That is where I'm going today. This man was just and devout. Was just and devout. When we read it more, we see that the Holy Spirit come upon him. And this Holy Spirit led him to the sanctuary, to the temple. The way Holy Spirit led you down here today. He has seen the glory in the Bible. The glory is waiting for is Jesus. One thing I want you to understand in the temple today. Simon, not Simon. We are all Simon. Amen. In the Bible. We are looking for one thing. For one thing we are looking for. It's not only the Simon in the Bible. But we are all Simon in the Bible. Here in that city today. We are looking for one thing in the Bible. And the only thing we are looking for is Jesus. The Bible qualifies Simon. It said he was just and devout. Right. When we're looking for brother Timothy Aditri, we all know he's partaking in this church. He's just and devout. He comes to church regularly. He observes the worship of Christ every, everything regularly and that's why the Holy Spirit was upon him this is the work of Holy Spirit and this is why we all made in our life the work of Holy Spirit when you hold on to that Jesus we lead you to many things now Holy Spirit was upon brother Timothy he led him to Nigeria to fetch him his wife, his beloved wife. <laughs> and when they met each other from London to Nigeria, it's not him, but the Holy Spirit. This, I want you to understand, this vision has been for a long time for Brother Timothy. That is going to marry a wife, a black wife is going to marry a Nigerian wife. This vision has been for a long time. But when God says he is devout and just, this Holy Spirit brought that wife and connected them together. Amen. That's the work of Holy Spirit about you to understand. And when he connected to it, them together, what they're supposed to be running as a sketcher, the Holy Spirit brought it once, once for them. They don't need to travel to Japan. They don't need to travel to Israel, Australia, or, or India to have the glory for the womb of the baby. That is the work of Holy Spirit. The work of Holy Spirit will wipe out your sorrow. Amen. As you come today, the Holy Spirit will wipe out your sorrow in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. They say, Simon, not 
Simon, but Brother Timothy, just and devout. And now, immediately as the Holy Spirit connected together, he blessed them with a bountiful baby girl. Hallelujah. With a new glory, with a queen. Amen. Because in Messiah this year, we are kings and queens. Amen. We are ruling. That's why you see Brother Timothy, the couple. They are ruling now. Amen. And God brought them the glory. A queen in the, in the family. The mother carried the queen for nine months. Do you know one thing? The mother did not sit for one day. Because that's the work of Holy Spirit. That's one thing I want you to understand. Brother Timothy was where he is serving God before the Holy Spirit ministered to him that he is going to marry a girl, a lady, a Nigerian lady, a beautiful lady, a black and nebony. Yeah. <laughs> and not the Holy Spirit connect them, look for them and connect them together. Yeah. And that's one thing I want you to understand. You all, we all need Jesus in our life. He said, when you accept that Jesus in your life, that Holy Spirit will come upon you. And that Holy Spirit come upon Simon. Jesus was not born before Holy Spirit come up, came upon Simon. But one thing I want you to understand is, Jesus is already in the life of Simon in the Bible. But he only wants to see the flesh, the flesh of Jesus. But that Holy Spirit has been in his life. So when you serve him, when he calls you to his worship, the way you are, don't come for the baby alone. Come for Jesus. That is the only finishing of your faith. That is the only man that can wipe out your sorrows. That is the only man that he can implement you and establish you. He established Brother Timothy. And it's one. And now they become one. And now God bless them with bountiful baby queen. And now they are rejoicing today. They are here because of the glory in the family. They are rejoicing today. You are rejoicing with them today because of the new glory God bestowed in the family. And I pray. And I pray today. I don't know what you are looking for. God, people will come and celebrate with you. Yeah. As we are sitting today, people will come from the east. Amen. People will come from the west. Amen. People will come from the north. Amen. People will come from the east Amen. and celebrate with you. Amen. The way you are celebrating with the family of Adet Chile today. Amen. As I'm preaching, I thank God for the life of my mother in Christ. Because the vision came from her that what is happening today. She is the genesis of this relationship. That's what we are saying. When you are worshipping God, that Holy Spirit will bestow upon you. The Holy Spirit was upon our mother in Christ. To give the vision. And because of that vision, we are celebrating the vision today. Praise God! Hallelujah. We are celebrating the vision today. The vision is that we're going to celebrate the queen in the family of Adi today. And we are celebrating today. And lastly, I want to tell you something. Can you help me look, look read and look to? 28. Look to 28. Then Jesus took him up in his arms. And then he took Savior. him up in his arms. Yes. And blessed God. And blessed God. And said. And said. Lord. Lord. Now let us thy servant depart in peace. Depart according peace. to thy word. Thank you. Because he has said the glory that Jesus is looking for. 
and they all oh, lift him up. Brother Timothy today is carrying the new glory in his life. The glory that God bestowed in his life is carrying the glory today. People are now seeing the glory. The baby, when the baby, when the baby is the womb of the mother for one month, for one week, up to nine, nine months, nobody said it. But today, you cannot say the glory. Amen. You cannot come from the east, from the south to celebrate the glory today. Amen. And now, when you are waiting upon Christ, wait patiently. Christ is bigger than your trouble. Christ is bigger than your problem. Christ is bigger than the child you are looking for. Christ is bigger than anything you might be looking for in your life. That's why you need Christ in your life. They say Simon lift Jesus up. We all want to lift up our glory in Jesus' name. When we look for him, the finisher for our faith. He said, Simon carry him the glory upon his life. You are going to carry the glory of Jesus Amen. upon your life. Amen. And now lastly, the family of Aditule. You are carrying the baby, you are carrying the glory right now. What you need to feed the baby now is the word of God. Please don't let her depart from the word of God. Bless her the way God bless you. With his richness. When you bless her from the from a child, it's going to see the way. The Bible says, only yes, okay, only tomorrow. Lord not Odara. Boba Tile. Hey Jerome, low. When it when he followed that, when he followed that line, you all going to rejoice in it. And the child will not be able to depart from the line. Amen. Please, the family of our today. This is the glory God has bestowed upon your life. Amen. Please, bless her with the word of God. Amen. Don't let her depart from the journey of her life from now, the journey of eternity. Please, bless her with the word of God. God has blessed you with the word of God. Don't let her depart from it. His father did not depart from the glory of God, from the word of God. That's why he's able to sit down here today. Can we all rise up? Sister, you know that? Clap for yourself. Clap, clap. Please let everybody clap for people. Yes, she has become a sister. It's not going to be only her. Jesus is good. Jesus is good. All the time. All the time. We are all gathered here today for a purpose. And the purpose is, why are we here? Can I ask someone, someone among the women? Yeah, woman from over there. Why are we here? Christian. Christian. Of of our new baby boy, a baby girl. Clap for her. From the men's side, why are we here, sir? Anybody? Different from what she said? To Christian, our baby. Among the choristers? Celebrate new glory in the family. All well and good. And Tima? To celebrate the queen. Praise the Lord, somebody. Amen. And from the altar. <laughs> Celebration galore. I know the reason why I said galore. Because um, within a month, I'm standing here and I'm happy to let you know that we have five babies within a month. Praise the Lord. Two boys and three girls just within a month so god is so good to us and that is why we are rejoicing it is not by our might not our power but everybody that comes for baby's christening 
That's what we always say anytime we come to the sanctuary on the eighth day to christen the baby. But there's one particular thing that we all do not know. Or we know we are not we are not used to it or we don't understand the purpose through which we we'll always bring a child to the presence of the Lord. Can we see the book of Luke? I'm not preaching, but the Holy Spirit directed me to let us be aware of this particular verse. Luke chapter 2, verse 22. And when the days of our purification, according to the law of Moses, were accomplished, they brought him to Jerusalem to present him to the Lord. Yes. But before that, go to verse 21, ma'am. And when the eight days were accomplished. When the eight days were accomplished, this baby is eight days today, isn't it? See, Mo, and my beautiful wife, daughter over there, today is the eighth day. And I believe everybody here understand that the baby is eight days today, yes? yes? For the christening of the child. Yes, we are all gathered here for the christening of the child. But we forget a very important part of the reason why children are always brought to the sanctuary to be christened. And that is what will be read in verse 22. The last verse will tell us the reason why babies are brought to the presence of the Lord, not only for christening. We'll see the reason now. Yes, ma'am, verse 22. And when the days of their purification, according to the law of Moses, were accomplished, yeah. They brought him to Jerusalem yes. to present him to the Lord. Praise the Lord, somebody. Amen. So we are here today to present this baby to the Lord. Not about christening alone. If it is about christening, of course, we can do that in our house. We can as well do that in the hospital. I've been to many hospitals to christen the baby before. Because for one reason or the other, they might not be privileged to bring the baby to the church. I've been in the church last week, Friday, cursing one of our boy uncle, I your only go on there. I was in his house on Friday. I christened the baby in the house. It is not a sin if that is happening. But if you should bring a child to the church for christening, you are presenting the child to the Lord. And that is why it will always become a sin upon any parent. Who has brought a child to the Lord on the eighth day not to always take the child before the presence of the Lord all the time? Because you have brought her here. Now she's innocent. She doesn't know. But you have given her to the Lord today. You need to continue to bring her to the Lord. Because that is the origin. That is the first outing that she will go from the hospital. So the importance of baby being in the presence of the Lord every day eighth day is to present him before him or her before the Lord. So today we are presenting our beautiful baby to the Lord today. And we all that are gathered here we are witness to this. We are what? A witness to this. So we are partaker of the life of this young angel. We are not just going to be here just for the christening. We want to be here to always remind the father and the mom, that how are you doing with our beautiful baby because we were there when you presented her to the Lord. And I'm very happy to announce that the husband, the father of the lovely baby is a worker in the house of the Lord. Amen. Timothy is a very steadfast, hardworking, very good spiritual son of mine. I love him so, so much. Very, very diligent. And anything that will bring the work of the work of the Lord down, Timo will fight it. He will say, they even gave him a name among the choristers. What's the name? Ilano. 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 Our is very long there. You know what it means. Ilano. He will tell them that, come, this is the Ilano. Because my grandmom is a prophetess and she's alive. She's aged and she will live many more years on the planet. Amen. Yes. He said, I was brought up by an aged prophetess. I was born in the house of the Lord. I was raised in the church. So I know the Ilano. 
Hey, hey, hey. Amen, somebody. So you know the Ilano. And my lovely daughter, wife, is has joined you. She will also continue to know the Ilano. And the new daughter, baby, will also continue to know the Ilano. And if you don't know the Ilano, anybody that knows the way is the one that will get to the end of the journey. If you are going to Bristol, you don't know how to get there, you will, look, you will miss your way. The journey, the direction. So he knows the direction. And that is why when he got to England, he made sure that he found a white garment church. And since he set his feet into this sanctuary, he has always been steadfast and consistent. And you know everybody knows him as Elan. The Lord is good all the time. And we are going to start with the question of our baby now. In our own um, Ilano, in our doctrine, in Mezasi and S. Church, we always believe in using the food that we can never ever rule out from our life. That is what we always use to question our baby. And it always has the Bible, biblical um, um, support. We're going to use water. In the question, Genesis chapter 1, verse 1 to 3, 1 to 5, the Lord told us that when the heaven and earth were to be created, the heart was empty, darkness all over the place, the world was not arranged, heaven and earth. But something happened. The Holy Spirit went to the surface of the water, over on the surface of the water. So meaning that water has been in existence even before everything was created. And that is why there's no single human being that doesn't have water in their system. Water is very, very important. And if you say you can do without water a day, then that means something is wrong. Because you must take in water daily and you must pass out water daily. So water is important. So we use water. And Jesus Christ even said that I am the water of life. If you drink from me, you will never go thirsty again. And the salmon, psalmist talked about honey. He said the word of the Lord is sweeter in his mouth than honey. So we want to put the honey into our mouth today so that the word of the Lord will never be bitter Amen. in our lip. Amen. She will always enjoy it anytime she hears the word of the Lord or she wants to give it out. Amen. And this is salt here. The Bible said we are the salt of the world. If the salt is the rubbish, one who can make it worthy. So if you are a very good chef, you know how to cook very well. I know we have a lot of women caterers here. If you have all the ingredients in your food without salt, the food will be tasteless. So these three items now, I will beseech the um, our fathers from the altar. In the name of Christ, Amen. she will live to the glory of the Lord. Prayer, Cute, 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 cute. Sleeping. You've got to wake up now. Wakey, wakey. This dress is so cute. Tiny size, minimum I won. Yeah, please, I will beseech each and every one of us to be on our feet, please, to honor the celebrity of today. So we are going to proceed into the question of the baby. And I will please say that as soon as you hear the word, the name being mentioned, please, we want you to mention, to repeat it after me. The reason is that we want the name to be registered in her ears, so that she knows that that name belongs to her. So I'll start with water. Omelaman Buwe. Omelaman Buwe. Permit me to do that in Yoruba. And the Keniki, Bumi Shota. No, who called Jesu? Jesu was a poor do me. And the Kentoba Munino, who built Nick Bemo. Mopala shame with you, Miss Ellen, when you will call Tibaba. Mm. 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 Mm.
Atifumi e GLA, yes. Sorry, we have to wake you up. I feel me say, Lenu ni wo koti omo. I feel me say, Lenu ni wo koti emi mi mo. Ni wo koti Jesus mo so omo mi ni wo koti. Talia. Talia. Oluwa sheun. Oluwa sheun. Adi ola. Adi ola. I just want to so go both side. Me dey call and wait you. Adi ola. Adi ola. Here are your meat today. Here are your meat today. I beg, babe. I beg, babe. Oluwa da mi lola. Oluwa da mi lola. An oluwa ba mi she. An oluwa ba mi she. Ayo mi ba mi kale. Ayo mi ba mi kale. Inu mi du. Inu mi du. Oluwa la she. Oluwa la she. Tebora. Tebora. That's the name that I'm giving her. That's the name from the Holy Spirit. Elia. Then you. Jago jago obiri, alagba ra obiri, aki kuchu obiri. Nipa ati ogun dete angwa kuri sasa ni debora jadi. When my face. When war came and the men ran away, debora came forward and said she was ready to face the war. So alagba ra, tayi onfim bori bobo kuaiye. So the power in which you used to overcome all the warfare of the world. Oh God, Jesus, Jesus, I feel free. Ah, Jesus, I feel free. Ah, Jesus, I feel free. Oyi, sugar do, sugar oyi do to sugar no. Sugar might be sweet, but honey is sweeter than sugar. David did to Psalm one hundred and fifty. David that wrote Psalm one hundred and fifty. Koyamile no score one hundred and fifty stamps. I was not surprised that he was able to write the psalm up to hundred and fifty. Tori yawo no because the word of God, he was not tired of the word of God. And the words of God were not bitter to him. He was always sweet to him. So as much as he says all these words, he was praising God. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. No go cut your mo. No go cut Jesus. We lay here to wa o ni mo iko. Ati Jesus. I don't know my mo. Ati Jesus. No go cut si eh mi mi mo. Ah, go she la o ni o do o o la ba go she eh o tu la no si o tu ngo ai ka ke go she tiri go ni do wa o tu do what then? That shows how she will enjoy sweetness. Amen. You will call Jesus on him or go. Amen. What is Kekere Moadu? You will call Jesus Adu now by a kale. Amen. Nigba ko nigba ti oju oti la mi ni sapo oju la ko to ya mama wa ti baba wa ni. In the old days, ko ti to ya mama baba wa ti mama wa. That is their knowledge and understanding of our forefathers. When they want to name a child. They will use the alligator pepper. They will use cola nuts. And they will use the cola. And then after a while, the child will begin to misbehave. The child will continue to misbehave. And they will be telling the child. The child that was given pepper on the christening day, what is expected of the child. But our own baby has been blessed with God. So surely her life has to be sweet. And the life of her elder sister. And the life of her parents. And the life of all her generation and her family. So will be sweet. So she 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 will be sweet. Anyone that has bitterness in their life wants the mother to be Talia. Oluwa sheun. Adi ola. Ira yo mi tite. Abegbe. Abegbe. Oluwa da mi lola. Oluwa da mi lola. Anu oluwa ba mi she. Anu oluwa ba mi she. Ayoba Mikale, Ayoba Mikale, Inu Mitu, Inu Mitu, Tolu Alashere, Tolu Alashere, Bora, Bora, Oh, Nije 
the reason why I've asked all of you to be on your feet is so that you can see what is happening here. So that things most especially so that this child will be entitled to standing ovation. People will be stretching out just to see the celebrity. Because sweetness has been put in her life on the Christian day. somebody Oh, ni je nobody. Yes. Eba mi so mo wa lo ko talia. Oluwa se o. Ade ola. Ade ola. Ya yo mi de. Abegbe. Oluwa da mi lola. An oluwa ba mi se. Ayo ba mi kale. Enu mi dun. Toluwa la se. Debora. Ati 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 before we take the child to the mother ah ni omo ni but ni si o now the child is a child but she has a name so do stop calling the child a uh, baby, baby what is her name okay. Hello, Hello, Now, I want to your hands The prayer we're about to say for her only to know has a meaning. A child, children are praying for her. <laughs> Abu, we will say, Lori, let the Gagab be Psalm 23. Oh, we're anointing you as the Psalm 23 says, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. I need to, 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 I for her, let us pray for her. Mama as she's going into the world, authority the Lord should remain with her. I have carried her. Other people will carry. A lot of people will carry her. Let us pray. The hand of death is not carrying her. The hand of illness is not carrying her. The hand of prison. The hand of abortion. The hand of police. The hand of police.
Let us pray that a new thing has come into this family. He has met an older sister. And she also must be blessed with a younger sibling. Yes. She must not be the last. The wealth in which her parents will use to train her. The knowledge, wisdom, and understanding in which they will use to train her. The Lord should be so long to them. The knowledge of God that supersedes all the knowledge of humans. The Lord should bless her with. The Lord should now we're taking Deborah to her mother. So that in Jolo. And as we're dancing there, the choristers will begin to sing.
quoted that Jesus Christ was taken into the sanctuary to be christened on the eighth day, which we have just done. And Jesus was given what? Silver and what? Yes. But what we want for the Borah today is pounds. Money. Money. Oh, I need it to worry. Yes, I need the silver, I need the gold. Oh, what do my feel? All I need. So now we are going to dip our hand into our pocket. We want to bless the Bora today. So you bring the money out while we pay on the money. Use the money to purchase the Bible. And they will present her with the Bible. And they will give the Bible to each other the words of God at all times, at all moments. I just got back. I just got your way. Let us bring up the money. Oh God, Jesus. Oh God, Jesus. Oh God, Jesus. Ah, ni no way, pull over a woman. It was back way job for me, be by a pen no wolf to do your job to my day, my book of power. No who called Chase to all that you are that Saturday, who lost our no longer your father. Yes, she is a person of the people. Chase to do our. I am very happy. I look both left and right and I can see the crowd that has come out to celebrate our brother. Yes. And you also more look on it, when you do it, you see your auntie Baba, it would be a boom of it. And his name is Christine, his child, in a land where you have no one and there are lots of people here with him. What would you enjoy share? And it's also a walking day. And this is how they've been calling his name, his nickname in Lano in the choir. Let us do good at all times. 
people think that your reward is in heaven but that's not true that's not true you get your reward here on earth lot of people think that your reward is in heaven but it starts you get your reward here on earth this goes to show me that if our brother is good in the church house of god then he's also good out there yes i do better well along for you we thank god for today you can see that there are a lot of visitors here even if we decide to come the members of Isaiah church were not as much as the visitors this goes to show that Timothy is a good man and he has very good things and he has very good things and he has very good we have just one prayer left and so this seed in which our brother and his wife planted in private now we can all see it hallelujah it can, we can see because it's out there. When they were planting this seed in private, they did not call any one of us. But when the glory of the Lord came forth, we began to see it. You would say this prayer that we normally pray when we're christening a child. You would dip your hand into your pocket. And so your seed. We want to sow a seed now. And you will tell God. There are some people that planted such seeds, and the people of the world did not let them repeat. They are trying as much as they saw. It did not come forth. You know all the things you've been laboring upon, and it has not come forth to materialize. You have been doing this from years past and there's nothing to show you. This prayer you will see on this morning is that your brother Timothy and his wife Yemi planted this seed in, in private and the whole world saw the result of it publicly. Let this seed and plant it, let it yield forth good public Result. Look, I want to joy beg you do not joke with this prayer a lot of people do not know what to only the thing that we do not ask for then that, that doesn't come i'm not being boastful before you say this prayer please can you open your eyes and look towards me timothy and one of his friends were here you're in the service score I did not know that they had both played football, uh, a ball, and they had scored the goal. And I was just giving a vision here. And the Lord told me to tell Timothy that yourself and your friend, you would have your children around the same time. I am not aware if your wives are pregnant. And the entire church shouted, Mommy, it is coming. But there was a thing the Lord said on that day, I did not say it. That the Lord said, immediately our brother Ayo has his baby. Brother Timothy will also have it. Meanwhile, he did it. Timothy, oh yeah, do tell your Lord. Whereas the he did the expected date of delivery of um, Sister Yemi was earlier than that of Brother Ayo's wife. So I wanna wait. Mommy, my son, wanna wait and you click. So they were even wondering that this vision is not really. But don't go long for more away, share. But because the Lord wants to bring His word. Only when somebody go bad, do I go long? She dare I do I? Yes, you go yeah. This is why I'm telling you to pray over the money. Our brother Ayo's wife went for an antenatal visit. She wasn't due to have a baby. And 
and the doctor told her she had to give birth no. immediately. The child must not stay in the womb till the next day. Yeah, well, no, what the doctor told me to call your mom. Last year, they didn't know a lady to have to call her. And the wife said she wasn't alive, no. but the doctor insisted the child had to be brought out if you really want to remain alive. It was about how long first she almost your Yahshua do it, but see, oh yeah, But because the word of the Lord wanted to come to pass. The child of our brother Ayo came forth, was born before her due date. To get to alone. Because it is the work of God. So if you go for a christening and you've been asked to sow a seed and you're wondering, we've just come to name a child, why are we being asked to sow a seed? Please be aware we're not forcing you, but if the spirit directs you to do it, please do it and you will not regret it. So for long, I want to go to the house. Tell the Lord all the hey. laboring upon and mm. as it be coming forth. Say this, make a date and have a covenant with the Lord. It was all over along the social media. But do I bash him back? I want to go over to TV. Tell you, Jeffo, you even if you are listening to us hey. online. Pray into the mountain, pray and say there are some things you've been laboring upon and you have yet to reap. I say, Tinny won't be. I say, T. I say, Patsy. I say, Possy left. Oh, baby. Some more long as I have hope I want to say, Tinny will lady. Tell the Lord, I mean, I have to visit that hey. things of obstruction today. Very long in the Bola came me at it, Momo, I say, Tinny, I say, Oh, my Lord, lady. There was no obstruction over our child, Deborah. Oh, yeah, Bessie, 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 to pray. Bessie, Jehovah. We normally give women the food, people the food that the child has finished it. Please may we be seated. We have done this a lot of time and good results has been yielded. People that also want yeah. to deliver children that want to be celebrated and make their children christened. We give them the food in which we use to christen the child, to name the child. We give to them. So I want to work with and go join the love of God and the true fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Goodness and mercy shall follow us Amen. all the days of our life, Amen. and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. As for now on, let no one disturb us, for we are carrying the mark of Jesus all over our body. Amen, amen, and amen in Jesus' name. Fire, Jah. <laughs>